My name is Sid Moen and I'm a Houston photographer. I saw a little planet uh, about four years ago on the internet and I thought I can do that and I found it very interesting. I've always been intrigued with uh, the spatial aspect of spherical photography. VR photography is virtual reality photography. So if you've ever gone to Google Maps and looked at a street view and where you can pan around and see 360 degrees around um, that block, that's VR photography. A stereographic projection is a mapping term and that's how a 3D sphere is mapped 2D. But you see a globe, you know, the Earth that you can kind of turn. Okay, that's a 3D thing, but you can also see uh, maps of the world that are 2D, and that would be a stereographic projection. I take 30 photographs, so I take a picture, picture, picture. So it's 360 degrees all the way around, and I get all the sky and all the ground. Uh, then I take it into the computer and I stitch the image together. Um, there are a lot of seams, so there's a bit of time in that. And then I use mapping software to help me get the little planet view. A 360 degree panorama is a spherical image and you can see the 3D aspect on a computer, but a little planet is the same image, only it's mapped 2D. That's the way you see all, the whole image around you. What I like about little planets, it's not like a traditional panorama where you're kind of looking like this. It's all in front of you, and uh, I, th I think that's what attracts me to it. And it's different. I like, I like that it's different. It's a little surrealistic, and I like that. And I'm always surprised at people who, who can say, oh, I know that. I mean, it's like I said, well, you get an A+, because you named all the locations, because sometimes I think some of them are a little obscure. I think what first attracts people is uh, whether it's an iconic image, let's say like the River Oaks Theater, which everybody loves that one. And I, w I want you to look at that and you know, I just want to attract you to my art first. Uh, and usually that's what it is, it'll be some iconic image that people know or you know, resonates with them. But once they get into it, then they start kind of looking around and you'll see people kind of turn in their head, you know, because they're kind of looking around and, and they're, they're going, oh, oh, there's that shop there, or, you know, there's that. So you do kind of connect to a place, um, even though it may not be the big fancy place, it's the little place that you see. Well, my favorite one is the shrimp boats. It was taken down in Galveston, uh, where the shrimp boats come in. I can't get the view now because there's a building, but it was a spectacular sky, and I love being down by the water, and I think, you know, working people are interesting too. Little planets, it's kind of the idea that the world revolves around me, and a little planet is a way to view one location where everything is focused on that one location and you can see all around it, but maybe you're focusing a little bit more on one part. Um, and it's just kind of a celebration of the place.